Welcome to this video podcast from the International Al Jolson Society. Starting as an audio podcast in 2007, this is a look into the works and legacy of the world's greatest entertainer, Al Jolson. An unrivaled star of stage, screen, and recording, his influences are felt even today, more than 60 years after his passing. This week's podcast is a tightly edited clip from the June 4th, 1941 Eddie Cantor program with guest star Al Jolson. Jolson didn't sing a lot on this show, but here's one song he performed. You won't hear him perform any place else. And with Eddie Cantor, this song is a natural. Why, it's Al Jolson! <laughs> What are you doing here? Well, Eddie, I came here tonight as a representative of the American Theater to congratulate you and Ida on your 27th wedding anniversary. Well, thank you. Thanks, Al. You know, Al, you were my best friend even when I was a bachelor. And I remember how surprised you were when I told you I was going to marry Ida. <laughs> yes, Eddie. But when you did get married, I knew it was going to last. After all, you were a very sincere guy. You were in love with him. Besides... When you pay two bucks for a licensed brother, you're going to get your money's worth. <laughs> well, your joke doesn't fit because I didn't pay for the license. Ida did. <laughs> I was only kidding, Eddie. Eddie, you've got a great gal, and I'd like to pay my tribute to your missus in the language I know best. Ida, sweet as apple sauce, Ida. Sweeter than all I know Come on out in the silvery moonlight Of love I'll whisper So soft and low, soft and low Seems though can't live without you Listen, my honey do Dilly do, oh I die I idolize you Because I love you I die If I do You know, folks The name Ida That's more than just the name of Eddie's wife It's something that stands for happiness Yes, sir A symbol of a successful married life They've come a long way together, those two, since those days down on old Henry Street. But to him, she's still just as sweet, and her glance when they meet makes his heart skip a beat. Of course, a heart like Eddie's wants to save a beat every chance it gets. Oh, go away, will you? You know, I never got to meet Ida, that is, in those early days of their romance. You see, I had to stay home all alone by myself. <laughs> Because Canner always borrowed my pants. Who needs the man? But their love is deep as the ocean. Their hearts are filled with devotion. They equal the record of Mr. Dione, except in slow motion. It's no wonder, Ida. Daddy says, I love ya. Did I do? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank Al Jolson for his graciousness in appearing here tonight and for turning over his check to Bundles for Britain. This entire radio program is available on the website of the International Al Jolson Society, www.jolson.org. That's J-O-L-S-O-N dot O-R-G. Along with many other radio shows, Jolson recordings, video clips, and information about the world's greatest entertainer. Be sure to visit the site and listen for the next podcast, as Al Jolson said in the words he made famous, You ain't heard nothing yet.